My name is Wes from Cube Design, and today we're just going to have a quick run through on what MX records are and how you can update them uh, to change where your email is hosted. So MX records are DNS records that tell the internet where to deliver emails for a specific domain name. So you have your website address and you'll have some DNS records attached to that called MX records, which will tell um, the internet where your emails should be delivered, your postal address basically. So we have, um, we're using Cloudflare to manage our DNS records. This is what these are. Um, they, your MX records might be with your domain registrar like 123reg or GoDaddy or SiteGround, whoever you purchase your domain name through. So right now these DNS records are saying that emails should be delivered to our mailbox at 123reg. That's what this is saying here. Um, we're not hosting our emails with 123reg though. We're hosting our mails with SiteGround. So then for them to be delivered successfully, we need to go to SiteGround, we need to find out what our MX records are, and then we need to add them to um, our DNS records, replace these 123 reg ones. So you can see we've got two records here, saying 123 reg, and here is our DNS zone editor, and we've got three um, MX records here. So we need to update these on Cloudflare, because that's where our DNS records are being hosted. So we're going to do the first one. So we're going to put this in here, and then make sure that this has got a priority of 10. And then we're going to do the second one. And then we've got a third. This changes from um, each provider, so maybe you've got more or less. Normally there's a minimum of two. So we need to add a new MX record because we just edited the previous ones. And this would be um, an at because it's the root domain name, bookandtaxis.co.uk need to put in the MX record we copied and the priority is 30. We know that because that's what it's got here. So we save that. So all three MX records have been added, which is great. So that now means emails will be delivered to um, SiteGround instead of 123reg. Uh, we got the, uh, we got a text record here for um, SPF. I'm not sure how to describe that. Oh, I'll get an answer here. So this helps with deliverability, basically. So by adding this record to your DNS, it just adds some proof when you're trying to send an email that it's come from an authorized uh, mail server. So to add this record, we need to add a text record so you can just pick one from the list here. That's what we want. And so we can click the edit to see what this says. Copy that. You got the name there, it's just the domain name again. So we just put an at in here. And we put that there. So that's saved. And also we got this um D Kim record, which is also related to emails, I think, and deliverability. Let me get a good. So again, uh, verifies email authenticity. So we want to add that to, um, we want to copy that across as well. So that's a, a C, C name record. So we can add a new record here. And again, it is the root domain name. Oh no, sorry, I'm wrong. We want to copy that. Let's do that. So 
is not the root domain. We'll put that in. And then we need to copy this. This is the target. So we put that in. Excellent. So those are all the records set up for you to uh, to receive emails and to be able to send emails and authenticate that it's coming from a genuine place. So that's all set up now. Um, you need to make sure that you've set up your email addresses on your hosting accounts. Right now we don't have any here. So we're just, for example, do that. And now we've got an email address set up with SiteGround. Um, Cloudflare is managing our DNS records. You will have a different provider. And now we'll start receiving emails to this email address. So thanks for watching. Thanks for everyone who has subscribed to the channel so far. If you could like and comment to the video, if you have any questions, please just drop me a message in the comments below and I'll speak to you on the next one.